Gen B Episode 3 feels like the perfect endpoint for the three-episode premiere. Our band of complex, likable heroes are finally fully formed, and the punchy, jaw-splitting action will leave you hungry for more. Homelander wanking under the pale moonlight, Termite rupturing his lover's entire lower body, A-Train reducing Huey's girlfriend to mush, the deep-eating Timothy. The boys' unforgettable moments are its most heightened, but even when the series felt like it was trying to one-up itself, each dose of shock and awe said something about its characters. Genby already feels like the stronger of the two in that regard, especially after episode 3 and its harrowing peek into how the existence of nearly every student at Godalkin is defined by betrayal. They were never given the choice to be a normie, and any and all violence is the result of that lack of agency. That, and they're all battling relatable issues, grief, imposter syndrome, varying dysphoria they just happen to be supercharged, and the show's handling of that unique burden is already proving to be 